Okay, so I've uh, rebooted the disk stations. So let's go to Storage Manager. This is the SSD cache feature. So this is it's talking about <clears throat> how they, uh, the functions of that. And I've got just the one uh, drive volume here. No cache created. And this is the the advisor SSD cache advisor utility. You can see here it, it shows you the recommended size. Unfortunately I can't go that big. Uh, I've got 300 gigabyte SSDs and one of the limitations on the system is that they only allow you to use about uh, one quarter of your available uh, system memory which I have four gigabytes so they let you use one gigabyte of system memory as the uh, index table into the cache and that limits you to about 230 gigabytes of cache size so let's actually see what happens so there's the two modes uh, if you do read only cache you can use one or two SSDs to create a cache to accelerate read speed of the volume or if you do a read write cache you need two SSDs and then it creates a RAID 1 cache uh, and I think RAID 1 is mirrored so the the two drives are, are copies of each other for redundancy so let's see next and there's the formatted size 279.46 I've got two of those yeah here's the cache size every one gigabyte of cache requires four megabytes of system memory only a quarter of the system memory and the unused memory you have expanded can be used for the cache so uh, I guess I'll go for the maximum size here and see what it does okay we suggest yeah and I, I picked uh, the Intel Enterprise SSDs read write cache as part do not uninstall so you have to remove uninstall the cache before you can actually remove it so understand all the warnings Let's see what, what we get here. Loading. So I kind of went with as big of a cache. Or you could get 300 gigabyte and then the next step up was 480. And I don't think it would uh, allow me to use the 480 efficiently. So 300 seemed to be the best shot. And also I noticed there's a 240 gig SSD and the 240 versus the 300 the sequential write speeds are higher on as you go to a bigger uh, SSD so we'll see how 300 works here I'll get back to you when it finishes it might take a while I don't know how long this uh, takes so I'll show you what I end up with Okay, it looks like it finished. That took about five minutes. Uh, one thing I noticed while this was running, this is the first time I've noticed something running on the, the disk station, uh, adding hardware uh, that you cannot access any of the network uh, share points. There we go. It gave me 279. I guess I got the full size uh, volume. And now you can see my memory, if you can see that down here, I'm at 37, 38 percent. So actually, now I'm actually using some of the memory I put in the system. I loaded, uh, when I got it, I went from 2 up to 4 gigs. So let's see what this says here. Cache mount, cache 1 normal, healthy, mounted volume 1, read write. I used up 1.09 gigabytes so I think that's all it'll let me use is about a quarter so I've actually used a little more than a quarter there's my two drives I've only used one percent of course it 
just started up so maybe I'll take a look at this later today or tomorrow and see what kind of hit rate because right now we're getting nothing 